of Hello. What's your name? Trin. And where do you live? Uh, I live in Blaine, Washington. In this mega meditation summit, what is your favorite part? Uh, just getting to know the people here. Uh, we've met a lot of a lot of people really from all over the country and all over the world. I love coming to events like this. Everybody's in a similar energy state. It's very, very high energy, and it just feels like home. So, well, what are your key takeaways from the event? Uh, key takeaways are there's a lot of more parallels between Ayurvedic medicine and Tibetan medicine that I've been learning from a lot of the participants here. I really enjoyed uh, listening to Papaji, I think his name is, uh, or Patrickie. I hadn't uh, had ever met him or known anything about him, so the first time I was seeing him on camera today, it was uh, very enjoyable. Mm -hmm. And what do you plan to implement from learning it from the sessions? Well, I'm just going to spend more time working with Ayurvedic doctors. You know, we already work with quite a few. We work with Hassan Lad and some of his physicians. Um, I think it's time we expanded that network, and, and that's really my key takeaway. So we're going to be looking for more Ayurvedic associations to become part of educating people on the benefits of plant medicine you know, instead of Western medicine. Western medicine really treats the symptoms, but Tibetan medicine, Ayurveda, it treats the cause of the problem. When you remove the cause of the problem, the problem dissolves. And so it's very different, but uh, it's something that, that I'm very passionate about and I've committed my life to sharing this knowledge with others. So what is your message for the youth regarding meditation? Message for the youth is, you know, you can spend all of your time out there in the world. You can be chasing the glittery, the glitter and the fashion and the cars and the travel, but at the end of the day, you don't really get to take any of that with you. What you get to take with you when you finish your experience here is what you cultivated within your own heart. Your mind has an energy and your heart has an energy. It's called a neural network. Your mind uses thoughts, your heart uses feelings and emotions. And so when you address supporting your heart and your heart self, that really flowers into supporting the health in all of your being, your mind, your body, and your spirit. So take the time to go within. It doesn't take long. 20 or 30 minutes a day is really all you need. And that will change your life and also enhance the trajectory that the universe has planned for your life. When you show up and you do the work, the universe shows up and rewards you for it. Thank you very much for your time. You're welcome.